if Luna Classic went to a dollar, the market cap for Luna Classic will be five times the market cap of Bitcoin, which is absolutely ridiculous, guys. It's not realistic at all. But I still get asked this question. Can Luna Classic go to a dollar? I think it's a bit of a misconception, guys. So I'll discuss why it can't go to a dollar with the current supply. But it's not completely impossible that Luna Classic goes to a dollar in the future. If you can burn a lot of the supply, then we can get to one cent, 10 cent, do five, 10 Xs. So I'll talk about market cap and supply do a bit of an education educational video to start off because i think there's lots of misconceptions people don't understand market cap and supply then guys i'll go into the nitty-gritty of luna classic there's lots of developments that are happening lots of new protocols l2s that are launching i'll talk about all of that guys i'm really excited for for luna classic the, the most excited i've been in in months for luna classic and especially for rack off is launched by my friend a lunatic and frag i'm part of the project as well so i'll talk about how this project could potentially burn luna classic and and most importantly guys binance the biggest exchange is still supporting luna classic they don't support or burn any other coins apart from luna classic and their own token bnb so that's really exciting exciting guys so guys I'll, I'll discuss all of that and at the end of the video guys i'll share with you my price prediction for luna classic for 2024 and if we can burn the supply i'll share with you the number that i think luna classic could potentially reach guys if you enjoyed my content I've, I've not created content for almost a year guys but i'm back now after traveling for a year i will be creating weekly content so stay tuned at the end of the video i'll give you guys a bit of a life update and the and the and the, and the content that i plan to share you can remember guys i used to share with you lots of nice plays i share with you exactly what i'm doing trading wise DeFi. i'll carry on doing that so i'll give you guys an update at the end of the video let's talk about luna classic now so guys is it possible for luna classic to go to a dollar so first thing i think the misconception uh, that i found in the luna classic or luna community is people still um, don't mix up luna and luna classic when they talk about luna classic they some people probably don't even know that luna exists and i know this is very basic if people that are more involved in the community that they, they know all this stuff but people that are casual investors i think there's still a misconception guys so luna guys after the crash doquan and tfo abandoned the luna classic chain luna classic chain is completely community owned if you you guys remember terror rebels i did lots of spaces with them after the crash and how we did the 1.2 percent burn and had governance and staking and we had a crazy luna classic pump and that's luna classic that's the community owned luna classic have crazy amount of supply and one of the reasons is once uh, when the usdc repegged uh depeg guys lots of Luna were uh, uh, minted and that's why luna classic supply is so much and if luna classic went to a dollar then as like i mentioned the supply would be too much it's just not not possible but if we can uh, reduce the supply which i'll explain in a bit more detail then yes luna classic price could be a lot higher so first reason why i think people still think that can go to a dollar is this misconception between luna 2.0 like i said uh, people might think it's, it's very simple and i'm not having a go at this person guys i do you know i went before i joined a uh, crypto even before crypto stock trading i got involved with you know trading oil and cannabis stocks i did understand a lot of this stuff back in 2016 2017 so again i'm just trying to educate you so i think that's one of the uh, misconceptions and let me know in the comment section below if you think that is a misconception or you think i'm just it's just one or two people or it's a wider issue the second reason i think is that people don't understand supply and market cap so guys market cap is the price of a single coin times the total number of coins so on coinbase you can go read it yourself market capitalization market cap is the total dollar value of all the shares of a community company stock or in the case of bitcoin or another cryptocurrency of all the coins that have been mint uh, that have been mined in crypto market cap is calculated by multiplying the total number of coins that have been minted by the price of a single coin at a given time if we look at the market cap uh, the supply of uh, luna classic is 5.4 trillion that is crazy guys so for for you to for luna classic price to be a lot higher you can literally see it's got to be five times the market cap of bitcoin and if you look at the uh, the supply of bitcoin it's 19 20 million or even less because you know a lot of bitcoin has been lost and, and all that cool stuff so market cap circulating supply of bitcoin is a lot less 21 uh, max 21 million is the max supply of bitcoin so that is a big thing you need to remember if you have a huge amount of supply usually the price of the token is less and you can times the market cap 
you can times the price and circulating supply for example cardano they have a huge amount of supply the price is in the you know dollars less than a dollar uh, bitcoin have less supply the price of bitcoin is a lot higher and you can compare some of the market caps which we will will compare uh, luna classic to other l2 chains uh, tron avax and see how high a luna classic price can go but that's something that you can do and you can compare the market cap to to gold and, and stock market to help you understand where uh, the price of luna classic can go so when you say a dollar it's it, it's literally impossible for it to go to a dollar with the with the supply that we have at the moment so guys for us to possibly for luna classic price to go up we have to burn tokens binance the biggest exchange burns this is a really good website check it out Lunk dash is from uh, Catty Crypto, a uh, very good website. You can see Binance have burnt a lot of tokens, but we need to burn more through on-chain as well. And we need to increase on-chain activity. One of the things I'm trying to do, guys, is uh, doing meme coin challenge. We've seen Solana doing lots of uh, volume with the Solana meme on pump.fun. I'm trying to do something similar on Luna Classic. Go check out some of the posts. Rackoff is the first meme coin that I've bought. There are a couple of other meme coins that I'm buying as well. Go check it out. If you are a Luna Classic bag, support the chain, guys. It's not going to, you have to work for your own bags. The, the, the coin's not going to go up on its own. Like myself, that's working for my bag. You have to do your bit as well. So check out the meme coins. They're risky, but you can play with a couple of hundred dollars, a couple of thousand dollars. And if it does 5x, 10x, the market cap is so low, you could potentially do quite well so i've explained to you how market cap price and supply works let's now compare the market cap for of luna classic to other chains so if we uh, look at here guys some of the l2s i mean you can't really compare uh, luna classic to ethereum there's so much going on in ethereum the number of builders users it's just you know two different worlds and again i'm a luna classic bull i'm part of the luna classic community but you have to be realistic guys I think you could potentially in the bull market compare Luna Classic to Polkadot, uh, potentially even near protocol, the 6 billion, 5 to 10 billion market cap could be a possibility. We saw Luna Classic hit 1 billion just with the burn tax and just hype. So if we can have utility, if we can have killer apps, potentially that's Rakoff. Rakoff uh, will be an anchor protocol, similar to anchor protocol, lending and borrowing protocol. There's lots of interest and eyes on Luna Classic. We just need to have some utility that the community can get behind lots of good projects probably with better tech than luna classic that are out there they don't unfortunately have the community if luna classic can have a half a decent app that people can use i think it can go up a lot higher so i think Luna Classic could be targeting a potential 5 to 10 billion market cap. It could obviously go a bit a lot higher. I'm being conservative potentially, or some some people say I'm being pessimistic. I'll let you decide, but I'm just sharing with you my opinion. So some of the apps that are being used, guys, Terraport. I'm going to be doing uh, working a lot more with Terraport, guys. Um, I've been using them for the meme coin trading. They've got Terra Casino as well. So Terraport and Terra Civita, Rexy, they've got, they're, they're doing cool stuff. Myata NFT place. I couldn't find the exact tags. That's uh, not, I've tagged them, but they've got a marketplace you can launch your nfts there lung penguins gerudo universe teratrium they've got uh, gaming projects launching they're burning as well so if you go back to the list you can see some of them here that they are burning terra casinos and i think teratrium is up there as well you can see these projects are burning we need more of these projects and then there's rwa as well so i'll be doing potentially a spaces or a video on rwa coming to alburn and uh, that's land rush go check it out I'll, I'll, I'll post about it as well that's quite exciting that's why i said there's lots of things happening if i've missed anything guys uh, on luna classic let me know in the comment section below I'll, I'll look into them like i said i really want to bring eyeballs and hype to luna classic projects guys and I'm doing my bit with the meme coin degen because that's what I'm good at trading, you know, trading, especially on a bull market, trading the breakouts, dips, pullbacks. That's my speciality. So I'm trying to help with Luna Classic meme coins. I'm also delving into Solana memes. Let me know in the comment section below my good friend, David's a Solana meme DJ and doing really well. I might delve into and get fully locked in into Solana memes as well. I think there's opportunity there, but I'm really trying to drive some volume in Luna Classic memes. And finally, guys, Rakoff, I've mentioned that they're, they're, they're building a lending and borrowing protocol, an anchor protocol, similar to anchor protocol, which has got me involved in Luna Classic initially. So I'm really excited to see that. We can see, guys, Rakoff went absolutely crazy, guys. It did like 100x. Uh, my first tweet after I came back from my travels was about Rakoff, and it went from uh, 1 mil to about a 10 mil market cap. I think it could go a lot higher. Since then, it's been dipping. I think it's, we're waiting for a Protocol X update. Uh, we, we, uh, Luna, Luna and frag are working with the devs once they have a way forward they're trying to 
figure out the legal and, and a lot of the setting up the company, crypto company process. After that, guys, uh, we can start working on the protocol. X. I think that's going to be really cool. I'm, I'm most excited about uh, Rakoff and what Rakoff can do in in the lunar classic space i think it can really if it can grow its tvl it could have huge price potential as well and check out my uh, spaces that i've done with lunar uh, lunatic lover i'll try and do some uh, more videos with ll69 on on my youtube as well and they're also guys that you can, you can check out my post that i did danny demi DeFi created this cool uh, uh cool picture what a rack off plan to do is guys some of the uh, fees or revenue that will be generated will go into community and oracle pools guys that's really going to help and any on-chain uh, activity we still have the burn tax not 1.2 percent but we still have the burn uh, burn tax which will chip in, in and reducing the supply which is going to be key to uh, you know we're moving the price up to higher values uh, that we want to see but like i've explained price doesn't mean much it's more of the market cap and supply it's a combination of of all those three and another thing I want to say is, guys, hopefully we deliver all this cool stuff. Even if we don't, we became a $1 billion market cap just by that burn tax. So potentially in a bull market, we could turn the burn tax on. That could be quite fun. It, it's controversial, but let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about potentially uh, bringing back that 1.2% burn tax. Finally, guys, you could do a redomination. So you could basically say, oh, if you own 100 uh, uh, Luna Classic or 1,000 uh, Lunk tokens, you, we're going to turn 1,000 into 10 uh, just in did that with BitTorrent. It doesn't really do much. So we could literally say we're going to burn, um, I don't know, four zeros and everyone's going to own less Lunk and, and show that Lunk is $1. But that doesn't really mean much. That's why I said it's not impossible, but it's just a fun thing. There's no point doing it, guys. We need to actually burn supply and, and move the price up. The most important thing is excess. It doesn't matter what value Lunk is, guys. It's just what price you buy it and what price you can sell. So redomination is one of the fun things we can do as like a hype, but it doesn't really do much. What's the point of it? So guys, my prediction here, guys. So I said that uh, you could potentially look at look at a five to ten billion market cap Luna Classic. And if that can happen and current market cap, we're not going to get to uh, that high. But if we could potentially burn another trillion of the market cap or if we could burn more, the price will be a lot higher. But we could potentially target a 0.0025 if we can deliver all this. Again, lots of ifs and buts and uh, we don't know what's going to happen. A lot of these projects have to deliver. Rakoff uh, TVL has to be blown up, blown up. People from other chains would want to come out and check out Luna Classic. If, if, if all those things happen, the price could go a lot higher and and I'm saying potentially this in a bull market could be a more realistic than the $1 price prediction. Let me know what you guys think. Not 0 0.0025. If we can burn another trillion or two trillion, we've seen we've burnt a lot of tokens already. And if we can move into the five to 10 billion market cap, not 0 0.0025. Could that be a possibility? Let me know in the comment section below, guys. More importantly, guys, I will be doing at least weekly content where I'll be sharing with you how I'm trading. So, uh, Lunk, a token on a high time frame, guys. We've dipped and we're retesting this sort of buy zone that we had. This is when we had the bull market start. So, what I'm thinking is we could potentially bottom round here and this is where I'm looking to trade. So if you guys have been following me, I posted this trade. This is a Rocco special. This is a trade that I like to take breakout pullback and that's exactly happened. You can go check out all these posts. So I, I quote to tweeted them and um, this was a breakout exactly pullback. This was my target. And if you go again, check the engagement, you can check the quote tweet and we've hit the target that i initially planned for the key now is guys flipping this level if we can flip this 0 0.001 level i think we can potentially get a, a sustained move another key thing is bitcoin needs to hold 60k potentially i'll do live streams and talk about bitcoin and other coins that i'm trading Kujira is another protocol that I'm really excited about. A chain link is another coin. I've been shilling it since $1. It did a crazy 50x, less than $1 actually. If you go uh, back, check my videos from three years ago. Maybe I'll create some fundamental uh, um video as well of uh, Kujira DeFi and, and how to stake Luna Classic, how to add liquidity and support the Rakoff project. So lots of videos coming. Let me know in the comment section below what type of content you want. Do you want Solana meme in a one to thousand dollar challenges, which I'm doing on Luna Classic? Let me know in the comment section below. But shorter time frame, guys, the key level for me, we need to flip this knot point, this red zone. If we can flip this red zone, guys, I'll 
post it on Twitter and potentially a video as well and I look to take a trade but for now if you took leverage trade you're using that setup that I shared that's your first target you could potentially buy the dip here as well for our pullback strategy but that will be like a more shorter time trade the big trade that I want to take next is above this level so not 0.0095 is where I have it or 4095 is a key level higher time frame guys like I've said it depends on Bitcoin if Bitcoin breaks out into new highs we can build hype you know some of the projects that I talked about rack off token or even some degen stuff with the burn tax again risky could backfire but potentially in a bull market why not try it why not build up hype and narrative that we saw worked for luna classic back then it won't be as effective but it could be something that we look at so yeah high time frame guys if we can flip that similar level that i shared previously i think we could be targeting this not point triple zero one five not point triple zero two level and then it depends on Bitcoin, a full bond blue, a bull market, the, the the burns and other things I talked about fundamentally. We could get to that, you know, the dream price level that I said uh, of 0.0025. That will be absolutely crazy. So, guys, this is the video, guys. Let me know what you guys think about this video. I'll be creating a lot more content. Um, we talk about Rackoff, Staking Luna Classic, other Luna Classic project, the RWA project that's launching on Luna Classic and potentially Luna Classic memes as well. So that's the Luna Classic focus. I'll keep you up to date weekly and I'm planning to do side content as well. One of the main things that I used to share is coins that I'm trading, coins that are breaking out and I used to trade it live with you guys and I plan to do that as well. So, you know, a couple of coins fundamentally I'm interested, Kujira, Chainlink, Rune is a coin that I like. I'll keep updating you guys on fundamentals as well. And then some DGEN plays, uh, Luna, Luna Classic meme coins, uh, potentially Ethereum base token meme coins and Solana meme coins. I think I need to spend some time with my friend and show you some Solana memes because there's lots of opportunities there. If you've if you've got less than $1,000, $10,000, I think that's where you can gain those crazy 100x, 10x trades and grow your account if you're more of a smaller, you know, four or five figure, six figure trader. So guys, that's the video. Thank you very much for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe. Subscribe. I'm, I'm gonna try and get to you gotta aim high guys i'm gonna try and get to 100k by end of this year it's, it's a crazy goal probably not gonna happen but you gotta aim high you gotta try it if i can share with you the content that i'm planning to share and help you make money i'm sure you guys will help me get to that level but thank you very much guys before i go comment below what's your price prediction for luna classic 2024